Today we'll learn a few ways to export a gravity sketch model to Autodesk Alias as a static reference. This is a sports car I recently created in Gravity Sketch. First as a quick 3D drawing before proceeding to a full sub-D surface model. To export your full model data, click the blue button on your non-drawing hand and select Save and Export. Select the FBX file format and click on Advanced Settings. You'll see a series of options including Mesh, NURBS, and Full Data. Select Full Data and go back to the Export menu and click the blue check mark. Name your file and export your file to the Landing Pad library. Go to Landing Pad, find your file by clicking Recents, highlight it, and click to download. Open Autodesk Alias, start a new workspace, and click File, Import File. Select your file and click Open. You'll see a couple versions of your model appearing as overlays. The first thing you'll need to do is ungroup everything. From there, you'll see what is essentially four versions of your model overlaid with each other. To illustrate, I'll move each version out of the way so you can see all four. The first is a basic mesh model, similar to a clay model scan. All details, including the wheels and tires, are included. You'll also notice the wireframe appears as a series of thin tapered tubes. The second model is a NURBS surface conversion. The sub-D faces have been converted to static surface patches. The third model is the base mesh of the original low poly geometry. It's not really of very much use and can be deleted. The fourth model is the 3D wireframe converted to editable CV curves. This is the only part of the model that is editable. Altogether, you have an excellent static reference model to pass along to your team for further 3D development in Alias.